gone. Are gone. Such a good song. Okay. Hey, Mari. What's up? I need you to sell your shit. Preparing for delivery. Okay, cool. Uh, we're gonna do a mod today. I promise. But first, we gotta check something out. All right. I got. I finally got around to getting laser guns, or I think they're laser guns. I don't know. Uh, some kind of. I don't know. Gun that doesn't shoot bullets, but shoots dwarven blasters. That's the one. Yes, yes. We're gonna hook up. Uh, what's her face, Mari? After this, I guess there's supposed to be a quest for this. I don't know. I couldn't figure it out. Not that I care to do a quest anyway. Uh, I'm not doing the automat. I'm gonna take all this ammo. Fuck you. Okay, and then we're gonna try it out inside my house, <laughs> so I can say that I did try these things out before I just forked them over to Mark. All right, this year is the Cryo Blaster. Behold. Oh fuck, I killed the fuck out of that mud crab. I'll never speak to you again. <laughs> Why did you do that? Oh my god, you're so upset. I just killed the fuck out of your mud crab. <laughs> Roar hates me so fucking much. <laughs> me, Lucia. What did I do? Oh, man, my kids are pissed. <laughs> Can I res it? Hold on. <laughs> Wait, I have a spell for that. Holy shit. Oh, we've gotten way up. I'm going to have to reload this. I don't know if I can deal with my children hating me. <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> oh, I can just uh, make player friend. Alright, let's give it a try. Boom. Mud crab, back to life! Another oh my god. I, be god! I bet the children are still angry with me. What? Why did you do that? Yeah, because I'm a I'm a real jerk sometimes. <laughs> Hold on, Ma what's that one? I was just looking at that spell. Make player for him. Okay, can we do that? Bam! Bam! We pals what? again? Why no. Would you do I'll that? Never speak to you again. Oh my god! I'm gonna reload this because I feel like a dick. <laughs> okay. We're reloading it. Such a dumb reason to reload a game. <laughs> if it was just Roar that was pissed at me, I could totally live with that. But not Lucia. That breaks my heart. Go get out of here. For delivery. Okay, anyway. I'm not have to do all that crap over again. Okay, hold on. Anyway, Cryo Blaster. That's a thing. That, wow. Are you listening to this? Uh, these sound effects too? Hold on. Oh, don't shoot the crap. Your children will hate you. See? Pew! I like the sound that one makes. Oh. Pew! Pretty cool, right? Yeah. All right, let's try something else. Uh, let's see. Now, I, I watched the video on this beforehand. And this is not... <laughs> this is not your traditional flamethrower. You know, the kind that, like, spits out a giant plume of flame. No, this is just... <laughs> I always forget what I've done in my house. <laughs> this is the stuff of nightmares. Okay. Pew! Is there, there supposed to be fire? Pretty... Well, maybe we have to actually shoot somebody with it. Hold on. Let's go to our neighbor's place, the, the necromancers. I do promise we're doing a real mod today, by the way. Uh, like... We'll get to it as soon as I'm done shooting people with these new guns I got for Mari. I just had to get her to laser guns, okay? I'm sorry. This will be real quick, I promise. We'll just shoot some necromancers, and it'll be all cool, man. Yeah, where's the fire? Is there supposed to be fire? Or maybe my game's like fucked up or something. I don't know. Uh, Yeah, that just looks like a normal crossbow bolt to me, but what do I know? Uh, anyway, the cryo... Wait, let me... Let's try the plasma gun. This was the one that really piqued my interest initially. Okay. Plasma gun! Did you hear that sound? Oh. Pew whoop! Oh, hey, there's Mari. What's up? Pew whoop! Listen to that. Pew whoop! Although, yeah, I'm not getting the, uh... Shouldn't there be, like, a blob of green that goes along with it? I don't know. It just strikes me as a normal crossbow, but makes funny noises. Which I am perfectly fine with. 
Oh, oh, I know what's wrong. I'm be I'm dumb. I'm sorry. I'm dumb. I didn't equip the damn plasma cells. Yeah, it's just firing normal bolts. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's much better. Okay, okay. I'm satisfied. <laughs> yeah, I'm giving that plasma thing to uh, uh, what what's her face for sure? Alva. Well, hey there. Hi there. Would you like something? We're doing a follower mod, by the way. I'll so be we sure have to, to put it Alva. to good use. Okay, Alva, you cold as ice. That's why you getting the cryolator. Where's the? It's not the cryolator. It's the cryo blaster. My bad. That's a Fallout 4 weapon. Okay. Uh, here, take all of these, the cryogen, and did you get the cryo blaster too? Did I give that to you? Okay. I don't think you can improve upon these either, so... Yeah, they're good as is. Bye now. I understand. Take the world by storm, dearest. Okay. Anyway. That's fun. Maybe I'll keep the flamethrower and poke around with it for a bit. We're doing a mod today. It's not the the Blasto mods. No, it's not those guns. It's a follower mod named Hell... Re Mari, what are you doing? Why did you... Whatever. It's called Hell Rising. That's Hell with one L. Alright, let me drop some, uh, some lore-ass knowledge on your asses right now, okay? Are your asses prepared? They better God be hey, Carl. You down. What the fuck did I do to you, Carl? What do you want from me now? Test this fucking plasma rifle on your bitch ass. Fucking Carl. <laughs> fuck you. Anyway, uh, Hell Rising. Yes, for those of you who don't abla Norse mythology, Hell was the daughter of Loki. Your and she's. Are you back already? <gasps> you got a new bow! Transport successful. Fantastic news. Okay. Oh. Oh, you got two red bows, a yellow bow. Oh, wow. Where's your green bow? Whatever. Fuck you, robot. I have a plasma gun. It's rad as fuck, and you don't even need to thank me for it. I will just understand that you will love me forever for giving you this. Okay. There you go. Now, brandish thine weapon. That looks good. Now you look like a proper robot. Did I ever tell you about the day when Anyway, uh, yeah, Hell Rising. You, There's supposed to be something going on younger. up in here. I can't Do imagine. I look for being young. No, you look like a oh, goddamn fucking robot. That's what you fucking look handsome. like. Self-conscious ass uh, fucking robot. Jesus H. Motherfucking after Christ. After Who's the man I talk to? What's you interesting, Thoring? saying. Hmm. Here. Take a look at this. A man came by and Don't left this bounty letter. Surprised. No shit. Mm-hmm. Alrighty. Bounty letter has been added to our inventory. Let us read it. To all adventurers and heroes in the pale. A few days ago, this one's trading caravan. Wait, this is clearly a Khajiit. This one. A few days ago, this one's trading caravan was ambushed by bandits near Fort Dunstead. Not only this one lost all the wares along the l along with the men guarding them, but also the Jarl is unable or unwilling to bring justice to those scoundrels. So this one will pay anyone to m in good gold who tracks down the bandits and ensures they never attack an honest merchant again. I will also be appreciated if any remaining goods of this one are returned to him. Once you have put an end to the bandit's threat and bring proof of the deed, you can meet this one at the Wind Peak Inn in Dunstar to collect your reward. Thamshur of Riverhold. I think that's a Khajiit? I don't know. He referred to himself as this one. Leave me alone. In that an Argonian, I guess. You. you what, Carl? Look. What? What, Don't Carl? What? What? Is it this? Is it because I yelled at you? Is that why you're all pissy? Now my robot's gonna shoot fucking plasma shots at you. Yeah, that's what you get for popping off at the fucking Dragonborn, you piece of shit, Carl. Fuck you! Hi, Sam. <laughs> you're cool. There's a guard. Let me pay off my bounty. This fucking Carl was at it again. Yeah, yeah. Hey, guard, can you relax? You have committed crimes against <laughs> yeah, Skyrim and her people. Uh, hey, I'm the Thane. Chill the fuck out. Oh, for we look the other way All this right, time. Cool. But even the Jarl's influence mm, has its Fuck thing. you, Sam. Be more careful. Just kidding. You're all right. Anyway, fuck. 
A merchant named Tam Shur has put a bounty out on some bandits who ambush his trading caravan. I should go to the location of the ambush and kill the fuck out of everything. All right. Where is it? I have found it. It is next to Fort Bellhammer. Okay. Ambush sight. I love the sound effects for these guns, man. They're so good. Okay, uh, ambush sight. Found it. Let us see. I have found a caravan horse. The horse must have been part of Tamshur's caravan. Killed by a deep cut in its side. Its innards have been partially eaten by scavengers. Gross. But thanks to the cold, the rest of the corpse is well preserved. Other than that, there is not much of interest to find here, so I should take a look around. Maybe I can find some leads on the attackers. Okay, why would you eat the innards of the horse if you didn't get access to the parts that aren't gross? That's my question, whatever. The corpse is covered with snow, but it is clearly visible that the skin is charred and partially burned down to the bones. It's hard to say if fire or lightning was the cause of was the cause, but it was definitely of magical nature. A few scraps of remaining clothing suggest that this was one of Damcher's men trying to crawl away after being struck by an arrow in the knee. <laughs> Where is my juice here? That was a that was a clever jape. Have some wine. <laughs> okay, anyway. Um anything else? Oh look, look, a broken crate. The crate is broken and full of shattered bottles. The smell of cheap wine still clings around here. Unfortunately, there is no useful trail here I could follow. Oh, there's trails I'm supposed to be following? Like a blood trail? The snow here is darkened by bloodstain. It looks like some fighting happened here and someone's artery had been hit. Leading south from here, I can see more traces of blood, but I don't think he could have gotten very far considering the blood loss. I should follow the trail to see where it leads me. But it might be better to wait for the day so I can see the blood more easily. Why? Follow the blood? I'm not waiting. Fuck. Why would you even suggest that? Fucking game. What <laughs> sound effects, man? I love it. Mari, I need more robotic ass shit for you, okay? <laughs> I just, I don't know. What I was initially looking for in a laser gun for Mari here was like an institute rifle from Fallout 4. I feel like she look, she looks very institute technology, right? You know, with the white, very clean robotic type steez going on, you know? But whatever. That, this was just the first gun mod I found. Dust Glow Crevice. Alright. Let's check it out. Oh. Oh. I think I done <laughs> went to the wrong cave. Or did I? Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a... Oh, guys, I done... I think that was the right cave, but I didn't do things in the right order. I didn't follow the blood trail properly. My bad. Bandit! Look! A badly drawn map. Let me guess, it takes me to that cave I was just in. Let's find out together, shall we? Okay, badly drawn map. Enter the cave. What do you fucking know? Huh? What do you... Wait, no. Or is it... A different cave? Huh. Maybe it is a different cave. Huh. Okay, never mind. We just did a cave for no reason. Another new area, Matt. Yes, good job, Mari. We have indeed mapped a new area. Did you get more blue in the face? Are you getting enough oxygen? Why are your eyes red yes. now? What is your deal, Robit? Okay. Do you need regularly scheduled maintenance? Do you need an upgrade to your software? To your, I don't know, your operating system? I, I, don't, I don't know. Okay. We have established that I initially went into the wrong cave, and I'm tempted to just uh, edit that whole excursion out. But <laughs> whatever, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Where's my cryo later? Everything will be much better if I have my. Wait, I gave that to Alva. That's right. I forgot. Okay, and napalm. Oh, fuck you, puppy. Ah, I killed the dog. Yeah. Target locked on. I can't believe my kids got 
pissed at me for killing the fucking mud crab. Uh, Assholes. <laughs> you children. Uh, <laughs> hey boys. Uh, what's up? Uh, that's what are you it. doing? That's all you've got. How? <laughs> like how he's still talking shit while his yeah. head was floating about. I fought what a fucking you. Goo. That takes talent. Oh. All right. My uh, my hats off to you. Speaking of hats, I totally didn't do this last episode. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm doing this in the middle of a fight. We, we got like a crown last episode, man. We did not even check it out. Old King's Crown. I bet it doesn't even work on Argonians. Does it? Hold on. <laughs> no. It totally does not work on Argonians. That's not fucking dumb. It probably works on Mari. God, that would make me angry. It probably does. It wouldn't fucking surprise me. Wanna try it out? Alright. Are you, you prepared to die? Who am I killing here? What is happening? I don't even I don't even I'm not sure what happened there. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, tried and true. Stab him in the stomach. Mari. You need to breathe. Your head is about to fall off, I swear. Okay, here, have a crown. It doesn't fit me or whatever. I just want to see if it works on you. Boom. It does not. Cool. Okay, good to know. All right. Well, this has been exciting. Understood. Anyway, I'm glad we established that the crown doesn't work. fucking work on people or lizards or robots. If I had Alva with me, I'd hook her up. But I her. Uh, find and kill the bandit leader. Don't need to tell me twice. That's like my favorite thing to do. What's going on back here? Huh? You're mine. You're fucking around, Mari. Oh. Hello. I'll rip you. Oh my god. Jeez. <laughs> nice try. <laughs> Seriously, I am not even trying to dodge these guys most of the time. They just swing and miss, man. It's great. <laughs> Phenomenal. Are you the bandit leader? I'm not saying that because you're an orc either. Is that racist? A lot of times the bandit leaders are orcs. Is that? That's not racist, is it? Seriously, I think Mari's suffocating to death. I'm not sure what to do about that. Wow. Okay. Uh... So I don't know if you people are looking at my compass, but there is a lot of red dots on my compass <laughs> currently. Alright. Well, best get to it, huh? Initiate much killing. Activating killing subroutines is what you should be doing, Mari. Oh, look at this. Oh, we have led them to the hot gates where the numbers count for them. Isn't that rad? Uh, Pretty fucking dope, if you ask me. Okay. <laughs> Who this? Wow, look at that lady. Look at this lady, huh? You're certainly something. You're not a typical bandit. You think you're important? I'm gonna kill you and then figure it out later. Is that cool? Alright, we're not in the hot gates anymore, so my strategy is not going to work anymore. Will you get out of me, late? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, you are the one that's being annoying. You, sir. And I want you to be dead now. Thank you. Okay. Thank you for obliging me so well. You won't live scumbag. All right. Demon friend. Uh, there's a lot of guys trying to kill me right now. Your assistance would be greatly appreciated. Mari, will you quit fucking around with these jerks? Jesus Christ. Okay, demon friend. Holding the line like a boss. You... Okay, we're gonna save Marcella for last. I'm gonna observe her and study her for science or alchemy or something. I don't know, because she's not a typical bandit, as you can probably tell. She has some modded haircut. Alright, which means she's important in some fucking way. I don't know. Video game mod, don't question it. Alright, that one's dead. Anybody left? Who is skulking about you, you running, so sir? You in the back. Back. <laughs> All right, Marcella, I will be with you momentarily. Okay, you, you are a person that's not normal. Let us observe you. I'm gonna choke the fucking shit out of you, girl. Yeah, you don't like that, do you? All right. Uh, other than the hair and the face, I think she's. Oh, I can't really see you. here. Get out of here. Okay, hold on. Don't move so much. All right. It's gonna look at you for a little bit. Don't even think about healing yourself. You All right, looks to. like she was eating some grape jam as well, as you can see by the uh, jam still remaining on her uh, lower jaw, on her chin. And uh, it looks like, yeah, the jelly she was eating, she also kind of missed her mouth a little bit, and she hit her eyeballs. 
Yeah, that's definitely what's going on here. Oh. And if you think, hey, Grim, maybe that's just war paint, you are ridiculous. <laughs> Don't even... What? What a ridiculous notion. Okay. Look for Tamshire's wares. We have a journal. We indeed have a journal. Let's check it out together. Marcella's journal. All right. Let me wet my whistle. I don't have... Hold on. Let me wet my whistle before we go ahead and, you know, read stuff. Thank you for obliging me, kind viewer. After getting rid of Halskar, I have took over this rabble of cutthroats. He thought it would be an easy game to get between my legs, but burning away his manhood taught it, teached him some manners. And after executing him in front of the others, they fell in line quite easily. They might be dumb brutes if they understand the concept, but they understand the concept of power. Now, I not only have a bunch of people for the dirty work, but also I finally found the entrance to Falandafarad. Falanda Falanda the ruins are buried deep below the mountain, exactly where the text said they would be. And this means that the fountain must also be down there. It is strange. I have searched so long for a way to prevent death and restore my health. I did so many experiments without any success, I had almost given up. And then, just by chance, I learned that this cult of ancient Norse already had found the secret. A fountain which waters were blessed by a long-forgotten goddess they had worship. Those who drink from its waters will be young again and live forever. The bandits refrain from going anywhere near the ruins entrance, and the magic barriers are still active. To get past it, I will only need to touch the skull in front of it and speak the following incantation. Um... Yeah, whatever the hell that is. But for now, I better leave it untouched. I don't like the idea of some dragger or worse getting up here. The ban the bandits might be tough, but would piss their pants on the first sight of an undead. It will be more wise to learn more about the ruins first and then to hire some able muscle from Whiterun or Dawnstar. Until then, I have to use that dumb bitch Orla to replenish my health. My sickness is getting slowly but or slowly but steady worse with every day. At least she is a decent bed warmer as long as she keeps her mouth shut. Ha 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 ha. Alright. Alright. That's neat. 